Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video here on Hypixel Skyblock, bro. Now, last time, we made, like, ourselves a space rod. We made ourselves the Scots. Uh, we got our flower minion over here. Oh, yeah, and we also defeated that freaking boss, bro. The broodmother boss. And, uh, yeah, dude, I still haven't, uh, reforged this thing. So, I think I'm gonna be doing that right now. But, uh, first, before we do that, bro, I got enough stuff to get myself a fire talisman and a healing talisman. But not only that, I can also get the reduced damage talisman bro all right so first let's make the healing talisman because this is gonna be really good so it takes two stacks to go all the way around to get 16 then you need 16 extra lily pads and get ourselves a healing talisman yeah it increases my healing <laughs> that'll be nice to have and then next let's make ourselves a fire talisman which takes nine enchanted blaze powder so not bad and provides immunity to fire while held in the inventory and then the last one is the reduced damage which just takes like uh, two times nine 18 sponges so yeah take five percent less damage from sea creatures oh and that's three new talismans but it's so weird the sea creature talisman and the healing talisman look exactly the same it's just the middle is like this one's red this one is blue so yeah i wonder how the upgraded ones look like we can get the healing ring right here and then it changes into that it has like a pink hat so so sea creature ring change, changes into like a blue hat and then the sea creature artifact changes into something completely different god damn okay oh, yeah dude, we are close to getting the stereo pants we're only like a couple away and for the challenging rod i still Still need a bit more lily pads. I have 227. So let's go to the hub and uh, let's uh, go upgrade these talismans, bro, into the reforger guy. Let's do the spider talisman first. Is it gonna cost 500? Yep. All right. Oh, more strength. I mean, let's see. And then the fire talisman, unpleasant. Uh, I think I wanna go for more strength. Crit damage. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll keep strong. Then sea creature talisman, strong as well. I'll keep that. And then the healing talisman. Damn. This one's a uh, pretty you the itchy one ominous oh yeah okay i'm keeping this one bro let's put this in our little talisman bag which uh wow we're only gonna be able to fit one more talisman in here oh you know two more oh god bro i want to see if this uh healing talisman actually works so we go into the deep caverns and then let's go to the sanctuary because that's where the most op mobs are at let me get out my grinding sword because i can still one punch these guys so yeah even with the diamond sword <laughs> i'm only doing this because uh, you get more money with scavenger so yeah let's see yeah these guys drop 30 coins every time if you have a scavenger three sword all right let's see i want to get hit by one of these guys and i want to see if i can heal fast so we're at 844 if i get hit come on i'm at 793 and then i heal up a bit fast all right pretty noticeable i like it it's pretty good i mean i think when it's like at 10 percent, it might be a bit more better so yeah dude that's gonna do a lot okay so i want to get to 60 levels real quick because i think i can make a the prismarine blade and i want to try that out because it does like 200 percent damage underwater so i'm kind of curious as to if that's gonna be like pretty good <laughs> like 200 percent more damage i mean it's not exactly 200 damage but it's something you know and the actual damage damage is like 50 damage and i think gives you like 25 strength uh, i think i don't know i'm not too sure let us see so all we need is a stack of prismarine shards and then we need to get ourselves some a uh, stick actually go to our crafting table do that and then we got our prismarine blade so it does 50 damage 25 strength and deals 200 percent damage while in water i mean this is like just for when you're fishing and if you go against like hard mobs right yesterday when i was fishing i freaking <laughs> ran into somebody who fished up a um an iron golem do that thing had like like over 200,000 health or something. No, I think I had like 24k health. Dude, that thing is... Oh. I'm not in the level yet for that. <laughs> that thing is gonna be OP, bro. I'm, I'm not ready for that at all. That's uh, gonna be pretty bad if I do say so myself. Uh, yeah, it looks like you can enchant this in a uh, enchant table. So I don't know what I want to go for. Probably impaling because... I mean, that only works for the guardians, I think. Let me check the enchant for it again. Yeah, impaling increased damage dealt by... Dealt to squid and guardians so yeah you can only get impaling three though oh look there's impaling three i mean it's gonna do a lot of damage to them guardians but i mean budget dude going for impaling three we got impaling three sharpness five and looting three. Oh, not bad i mean i think if i were to get um first strike on this thing it might be good let me see if i have a first strike book yeah i guess i'll use this on the thing i wonder how much it's just gonna cost it's gonna cost six xp <laughs> all right dude so let's put a first strike on this shall we so we're gonna have impaling sharpness first strike and looting so ooh. <laughs> that's looking pretty good bro i mean i don't know if this is 
is gonna do like more damage than my golem sword but hey man might as well like test it out you know <laughs> let's uh go fish up some i don't know sea guardians or some sea walkers and see if i, I do more damage but i need to be in the water of course so i guess i could test it out on a squid and see how much damage i'll do to that since they always come out in the water you know so i don't know should i fish in the water hold on let me put on my angler outfit oh well looks like we got ourselves a squid so let's see if i hit it 2624 damage dude, that does way more than my golem sword dude if it does 2000 damage like that because my uh, golem sword it usually does like 1600 damage normal and imagine if i hit a crit with this i think it'll do like 4k or 5k all right let's see this guy has 3000 health i have first strike i don't have giant killer 1000 1600 that's it so i bet you if i had a giant killer on this it would it would have done a lot more damage to it because i have giant killer on my golem sword so yeah that one had more health than me oh dude we can test it on this guy it does 2000 2270 so not bad bro i guess this prismarine blade could be useful all right bro <laughs> i'm not gonna lie um uh i did go for a bit more enchants bro it was cheap you know i was, I was going for the gods <laughs> god prismarine blade dude so yeah we're gonna have impaling first strike looting three sharpness five scavenger three giant killer and we're also gonna be adding in experience three bro look at is this better than my god sword no it's not <laughs> i was about to say bro oh my god well, this is gonna be my new um uh, grind uh, sword you know remember when we made this uh, grind sword right here sharp five scavenger first strike and all that this thing dude is gonna it's gonna be replaced by this prismarine blade <laughs> uh, i might as well just give this to him you know if he wants to grind even though he doesn't really have that much strength yet but uh my oh my dude we got ourselves a god prismarine blade dude pretty much like has everything that it needs for the mobs to like kill him fast enough you know nah i went to the sanctuary dude and it did over like 700 base damage and then it did like 1000 crit i think i don't know but uh i want to go and uh reforge this hopefully we can reforge it dude not i'll be pissed oh we can it's gonna cost 500 coins too and it's uncommon as well plus two strength nah hurtful nah epic damn bro i mean i don't know forceful i mean ah because i don't know which one is oh fair oh oh yeah we're, we're keeping that you know what dude i kind of want to uh, rotate out some of this stuff on my angler the forging thing whatever so i'm gonna change the chest plate and leggings because i want them to have a uh, zealous instead the only reason i want to do that is because i want to get that crit chance you know superior i mean it's the same thing as zealous except not the plus one intelligence so oh my god i got eyes on these leggings bro <laughs> okay yep we're keeping fierce dude. i can't get zealous we got ourselves a wise <laughs> outfit thingy bro oh my gosh okay what does my okay my boots has that i mean should i i want to kind of want to change my spacer set as well except um i like to have a lot of damage too you know like this one i got strength 10 then i got some like oh this one i only have like great damage is just light basically i think i might change my helmet actually oh demonic gives me a lot of intelligence and strength okay we got ourselves wise okay <laughs> we got 20 total strength if i wear this whole set now we're gonna change our boots okay i got demonic all right okay demonic okay i'll keep that all right now we have 253 total mana we got weiss helmet we got demonic chest plate demonic leggings and demonic boots so we got three times three that's nine total strength 15 times three that is uh 45 more mana and then we got 65 mana plus three health and plus two speed now we have a lot of speed <laughs> okay how much speed do i have right now 148 all right so if i uh one two three four five i can do this five times i get up to 248 speed and if i use fishing rod ooh, damn bro yeah dude i like the mana bro i'm keeping the mana set oh all right i mean yeah i could go for a full-on y set but i think i'll do that later in the future when i i want to spend a lot more money on it but for now i'm just i want to keep enough money for now so yeah dude the mana also regenerates so fast too man that's uh pretty good all right dude now it's time to test out this new prismarine blade with all the enchants so the giant killer is gonna come in handy impaling and first strike and sharpness is gonna do pretty good i mean like this fishing area right here you can use this blade and it'll be like really helpful you're gonna want freaking depth strider that's for sure because if you don't have depth strider then there's no point of you using this blade because you can't really fight in the water if you don't have depth strider at all so better if you have depth strider and then you can use this blade chanted clay oh dude i think i have enough to make ourselves a clay minion now that'll be a new slot oh wait oh 1960 no stop hitting me 1687 me uh, not too bad it's all right i guess i got a seawalker 
at 3,435. My sword, I think, could have done like 3,900 maybe. And I think they also fixed the um uh, the way for players to get your stuff when you're fishing. There's like a three to five second protection timer, I guess. So yeah, you shouldn't really be worried about people like hogging your fishing rod at all because they can't take it. And if they kill your creature that you fished out, they can't get the loot for like five seconds. Only you can. So if somebody kills the creature for you, you can still get the loot because they can't pick it up for like a few seconds and there's that if you guys didn't know that and if you're fishing a lot so we got ourselves a skeleton i use my demonic does 4691 i think my demonic does a bit more damage bro i mean it's, because, it's probably because of the strength i'm not gonna lie so <laughs> yeah the strength is helping out a lot so i think my yeah my golem sword does a bit more than my prismarine blade this uh prismarine blade is uh, pretty good if you're if you don't really have like a god sword yet or anything like that you can use this if you're fishing or you can use it in general like you can use it outside you can go into the sanctuary you can freaking one tap some of the mobs in there if you don't have a blaze or or if you don't have again any other god sword so yeah but yeah the 2000 damage against a skeleton when i'm in the water so yeah and this ought to be fully inside the water you know like drowning which uh I ain't trying to drown, bro. I mean, if you guys want to make yourselves a prismarine blade, you can. And I guess you can make this like your god sword. It'll work out. It'll be good. So, 84 strength. And then if we do this, it does 1,000. 1,000. 682 base damage. Uh, let's see. So, I have 75 strength. <laughs> and no armor on. I'm scared, bro. I don't want to get one shot. I mean, I shouldn't get one shot. So 1,094, so yeah, I mean, I don't know how much you guys start off. I think you start off with like 50 strength, uh, maybe, I don't know. So if you get like 70 strength total in your whole stats, then you do at least 1,000 damage with this. Yeah, and then if we use our golem sword on these guys, uh, we do 3,000 crits. And normal damage, I think it's like 1,600. All right, dude, I want to make myself this uh, clay minion real quick. So we need like a second 20. Then we do this, and then we're Gucci, man. We got ourselves a clay minion. Minion. So now we need to craft 14 more unique stuff in order to place on our 16 slot. So not bad. And yeah, I'm also close to upgrading this flower minion because I got her up to level 3, I think. Yeah, level 3. Just need a bunch of stacks of those and then we'll begin. Now I think I'm going to be doing, bro. I think I'm going to change the color of my outfit. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make it like different colors. Let's get red and then let's get orange. Why not? All right, one more. I right, saw so this it gives me magenta. This gives me also magenta. So I guess I might as well do this one then. Magenta, this pink. Oh yeah. Orange. Yeah. Red. Oh yeah. Blue. Oh yeah. I gotta like. I kind of want to go for a full pink outfit. <laughs> let's go for red chest plate. Wait, that does not look like red, bro. What the hell, bro? This looks disgusting. Bro, I think I had to like constantly keep on putting it on to make it look better. You know looking a bit nicer i think i'm just gonna go for full-on pink bro there's that and then let's do this gotta change it how many times i can do it imagine it goes like pure pink all right bro got ourselves a full-on pink speedster set <laughs> yeah i'm gonna keep that i mean i did like the white but i uh, want to change up the colors you know gonna be a little bit different all right dude i think uh, i'm gonna be making a second layer to this because i want to i need to have more chests to be honest because and there's gonna be new items soon and i'm gonna need a lot more storage than just uh these especially for the fish bro i think i'm gonna start building a bit more i'm gonna make like a staircase right here in the middle i mean should i make it out of freaking slabs or should i make it out of staircases <laughs> Alright, dude, I finished uh, making this whole thing right here. Yeah, now we have like two floors now, and uh, I covered up this whole top too. I made some staircases going up. I changed it from the slabs to staircases instead. Because, I don't know, I kind of like this staircases more in slabs. You needed to use like a lot. Yeah, and then I made this little middle area right here where I could just drop all the way down to the bottom if I wanted to. And then this is where I put uh, more chests on this second layer, bro. I already put in some like signs already. We got extra vowels, extra wood, and enchanted books. This is where I'm going to be putting some of my fish stuff now. Like the lily pads and prismarine stuff and all that. So, looks pretty noise uh, sort of <laughs> but, uh, yeah dude, i made like the same design again except right here on this top layer i did some glass and some wood i was thinking of doing uh stone bricks right here but nah let's see if we take a look at how much stuff we got i mean this whole bottom row is fully filled with raw pork chop already so yeah that's like 25 dubs right there and then 
Except for this one, that's a rip. Yeah, they started to go up on the second layer now. Budgie you, dude, I'm gonna turn them into enchantment. Alright, dude, I finished making <laughs> all those dubs. I got to take a while, but uh, you gotta see 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14 stacks out of that whole thing, bro. 25 dubs and some from the second row as well. So that's pretty good, dude. That's pretty good. I think I can only make like 40. Yeah, I mean, I can make another one, but we do have some more enchanted raw pork right here. So, one, two, three, four, five. And then we got ourselves six grilled. We got 15 out of 48 grilled pork now, bro. Uh, slowly but surely, bro. We got like four out of this whole thing, like a full on 25 dubs. And then we did a little bit from the top. So, yeah, dude, not bad, not bad. I think I'm gonna end up so right here. I might switch out these two guys, maybe, and just put like more big minions there. And the fish one i'm gonna keep them because i'm trying to get all the collections up and then the ghast i might replace them as well so that i can have more pigs as well so anyways uh thanks for watching and uh, i'll catch you guys in the next one